I'm the purple praying mantis, uh, PPM. I'm the purple praying mantis, uh, PPM. I'm the purple praying. Solo Sokoa. South Korea hates Solo Sokoa. Y'all already know who it is, man. It's your boy, Jay Aries. But peep this, right? Let's read this. I saw this floating around on Twitter. South Korea has its Reddit esque website called DC Inside and is extremely popular within the country. They have their subreddits and they call it galleries. DC Inside has a gallery that has a striking resemblance of R squared circle called Pro Wrestling Gallery. Here's what the Korean IWC voted. So South Korea had their own wrestling awards, best of and worst of. It says the voting process starts off with a preliminary round where the voters choose their, uh, choose their choices. Nomination period was until December 23rd. The rules for the awards was that each voter had three votes for each category. 805 users voted for the best and 562 users voted for the worst of awards. Now, that, that's a lot of people. There's a lot of people. See, we're going to see what this shit talking about. They said the best. Best male wrestler of the year. Is this only WWE? The fuck? Best male wrestler of the year, L.A. Knight with 406, Cody Rhodes second, Burger. Um, honorable mention to Miz, Ilya, Will Ospreay. Ospreay being an honorable mention is crazy. They do not know ball. Best female wrestler of the year, Rhea Ripley winning this is insane. She does have crazy aura, but Rhea winning this over freaking Athena, over Trinity, I don't know. This is bad. I don't even think. Did Rhea have a better year than Stratton? I guess. I mean, look at it. She won the Rumble from one. The first half of the year was better than the second half. But, I mean, I guess. That's a big I guess for me. Tag Team of the Year. Judge, um, best Team of the Year. I mean, Judgment Day. I don't even know how Damage Control is third. Bloodline fourth. Pretty deadly. They spelled deadly wrong. Honorable mention LWO, Usos, Creed's. Judgment Day winning with an astounding 423 vote lead. Damn, damn, damn. Best baby face of the year, Cody Fraud. As he, <coughs> bless you. Thank you. Cody Fraud, as expected. LA Knight could have won this. Jay Uso could have won this. Damn. Actually, no, he couldn't. 283. Sammy with 269 votes. Honorable mention, Ilya. Damn, they, I guess they love Ilya, but not enough to let him win anything. Best heel of the year, Dominic. This is understandable. It's not really a debate, to be honest. Roman coming in at fifth with 210 votes. I don't really think this is a debate. Best champion of the year, Gunter. Understandable choice, as much as I love Roman. That's fair. Uh, honorable mention, Roman. WWE Undisputed Universal Champion. Osprey IWGP United States Champion. Judgment Day. Okay. That's fair. Uh, Ilya came in fifth. Gunter winning by an astounding... I'm not doing that math right now. I'm sorry. Best worker of the year, Gunter. Gunter winning by 224 votes, beating out Seth Rollins. Gunter being voted the best worker of the year. Okay, I guess they know ball a little bit. They know ball a little bit. The Miz, Sami Zayn, Kevin Owens, honorable mention. Best match of the year. Drew McIntyre versus Gunter versus Sheamus. This match was insane. They only won by 15 votes. Only won by 15 votes. This match could have won... KO and Sammy versus Usos could have won. Charlotte versus Rhea, amazing match. Could have main evented. Chad Gable versus Gunter on the episode of Raw was amazing. Men's War Game match was great. It was an aura fest. Gunter versus The Miz was great. Kenny versus Will. Kenny versus Will only getting 98 votes is what's really surprising to me. And then you have the Men's Royal, or the Men's Royal Rumble match. Dijak versus Ilya. Roman and Solo versus Usos. Roman versus Sammy. That match was phenomenal. Best segment of the year. Sammy smashes Roman with a steel chair. That's fair. That's understandable. This segment was great, too. I'm surprised it came in second, though. Jay saying, you out when I'm out, too. Child of Sammy Zayn. Mm. Okay. So, we could tell that South Korea fucks with WWE a lot. Not really, not really a hot take. South Korea fucks with WWE a lot. Um... Paul Heyman provokes Cody and tells that Dusty wanted Roman Reigns as a son. Damn, damn. Randy proclaims his return, says Daddy's back. Miz declares to Gunter he can get serious on every one suit. Don't know why that's in the running. Best moment of the year, CM Punk returns to WWE after a decade. That's understandable. That's fair. 
They only won by 20 votes. Sammy betraying Roman could have easily won. I'm not going to front, but they didn't. That shit was crazy, bro. I literally was crying. Tears were coming out my eyes, bro. When, Rand, when Randy and CM Punk came back, I threw up. Because I was like, it was too much for me. Like, I threw up. Roman getting pinned for the first time in 1,200 days. Damn, damn. Best feud of the year, Roman versus Sammy. Out of these feuds, yes. That's fair. Out of these feuds, yes. That is fair. That is fair. That's real. Best catchphrase of the year. This isn't in bold, but LA Knight actually won with yeah. Beating his actually other catchphrase by 340 votes. So all together, he has like over a thousand votes for this. That's very impressive. Yeet. Whoa, 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 thank you. Never say never. This is corny. Hey, you know it. Yes, boy. Whoop that trick. Daddy's back. Best new of the year, Dragon Lee. That's fair. I think JD, my pick would have been JD, but Dragon Lee is like that. That's just me. I think JD's character work is phenomenal. Uh, Maxine's still a little green. She's showing vast, vast improvement, but she's still a little green. I love Pretty Deadly. Love Grayson Waller. Love the Creed Brothers. Lexus King, not really that too high on. I'm hoping I warm up to him. Best mic worker of the year. The Miz winning this is very wild. LA Knight could have won this. Much as I hate this burger, Cody probably could have won this shit. Actually, nah, fuck him. Nah, the Miz is wild, though. That's wild, low-key. I did not think the Miz would get chosen. Best non-wrestler of the year, Triple H. Uh, they, I'm surprised Paul Heyman didn't win this. They chose Triple H. That's it. That's interesting. Jung Chan Wu is a Korean color commentator for WWE shows of IB Sports. He's the GOAT. I mean, I've never heard him, so what can I say? Most improved. Not even a debate. Oh, my God. Dom is so much better than he was last. Even not even just last year. When he first, first started, Dom is so much better, bro. Not even a debate. Easily the most improved wrestler of the year by far across every company. Most notable wrestler next year, LA Knight. It's not a hot take. That's, that's real. Punk coming in at second. I mean, I suppose so. Yeah. Best move of the year, H-Bomb. That H-Bomb, crazy, bro. The one he had against Carmelo. Oh, my God, that shit was crazy. H-Bomb, Chaos Theory, RKO, The Chop, The Fuck, Aluva Kick, The Stomp, Torpedo Moscow, BFT. My favorite move on here is the Torpedo Moscow. Now, it looks to me like South Korea really fucks with Ilya. This is the first thing that he's actually won. It looks like South Korea, like, really fucks with Ilya because I've seen him nominated multiple, multiple times. Best gimmick of the year, Dirty Dom. Okay. That's real. That's, that's real. Mm. No, that's that's fine. That's fine. My favorite gimmick on here is the ring then or, uh, but News of the year. CM Punk returned to WWE after a decade. I do not think Bray Wyatt dying should be a category on this. I do not. But... If it had to be, whatever. But I do not think Barry Wyatt should have been a category on here. Punk fired by Yo, this day was very traumatizing, bro. This day was very traumatic. I'm going to reach a thousand days. Turn of your CM Punk. Only thing that comes close out of everything is Randy Orton, bro. The Rock come back to school? No. The only thing that comes close to CM Punk return is Randy Orton because it happened like a half hour before. Nah, not even a half hour because it happened like 15, 20 minutes before, bro. Only thing. Best theme of the year is not Kingdom, oh my fucking God. Code of Personality better than Kingdom. Welcome to LA better than Kingdom. Voices better than Kingdom. Worlds Apart better than Kingdom. Visionary better than Kingdom. Head of the Table better than Kingdom. The Other Side better than Kingdom. Made of an Ish better than Kingdom. Locked In better than Kingdom. Trick Williams theme definitely better than Kingdom. Fuck Kingdom. What the fuck? Brand of the year. I ain't gonna lie. If I was to vote for this, I'm voting NXT. But obviously, like I said, 
South Korea obviously favors WWE. I'd never heard of Pro Wrestling Society independent promotion in South Korea. That's cool. New Japan only get 46 votes. And all Elite uh, AEW only getting 24 votes. Very surprising. SmackDown won it by 40 votes. I ain't gonna lie. I think NXT has been the best show all year. I think Shawn Michaels was Booker of the Year last year. Best event of the year. Mania 39 night. Mania 39 day two, man. I mean, day one, man. Mania 39 day one was fucking crazy, bro. That night was phenomenal. Phenomenal night of wrestling, bro. That shit was lit, bro. Oh, my God. It's a feeling that watching both. Now, I love night two as well, but watching both nights of WrestleMania, it was a feeling that I can only hope gets recreated when I go to WrestleMania, bro. It was it was it felt amazing. Like thirty nine had that that or it had that oomph. It had that shit behind it. That's part time of the year. Logan Paul. Nah, that's real. Cena could have won, but that's real. Trish also had a match of the year candidate. But Logan Paul, he's been great for the company. He's been a great performer. Yeah, better and better. That's real. Best booker of the year. Only two options is crazy. No respect to Tony Khan. No respect to Gato. No respect to Scott Demore. Best Booker of the Year goes to Hunter Hearst Helmsley Triple H, man. That's real. Sean was close, losing by 13 votes, but that's real. Best main event of the year. This is not a main event. They cheated so that Sammy could win another award, but whatever. If I had to choose the main event of the year, I'm choosing Roman versus Cody. That match was virtually perfect. Y'all undermining that match severely. Let's face turn of the year. I don't know. Mention Roman versus Cody. KO and Sammy versus Roman and Solo. The match was great. Best face turn of the year. Jay Uso. Not over Sammy. Hell no. Not over Sammy. Not over Sammy. Y'all crazy. That's heel turn of the year, Santos. That's called Bar. Yeah. And Drew, not even a heel. Drew a tweener right now. But, no, nah, that's fair. That's fair. Now, the worst. Now, this is where we see some hating ass shit, bro. South Korea hates Solo Sokoa. Let's look. Worst male wrestler of the year. Solo Sokoa, 466 votes. I don't know why they voted Roman Reigns. I should sock all them niggas, bro. I don't know why they voted Roman Reigns with 298. But worst wrestler of the year, Solo Sokoa. Worst female wrestler of the year, Shotzi. Y'all know how I feel about Shotzi, man. But she has gotten better. But y'all know how I feel about Shotzi. I honestly think Ronda should have won this shit. Ronda did not try this year. And she sunk it up by SummerSlam. Worst team of the year, the bloodline. I don't know how Ronda and Shayna didn't win, but whatever. That, that shit crazy. And Indus sure only got 81 votes. Like, give me a fucking break. Where's Babyface to your shots? He damn. And how did Adam, how did Copeland get 325 votes? They need to put some respect on my nigga day. And I think my nigga Copeland just fucking saved the world's end. That shitty ass pay per view. Where's Heal of the Year? Solo Sokoa. That's two. That's two Solo Sokoa votes. Three, if you count the bloodline being voted worst team of the year. So, let's count that. Worst heel of the year. Solo Sokoa is not the worst heel of the year. The worst heel of the year is Lexus King. And I don't even have that much of an issue with Lexus King. I'm just saying. Them niggas keeping the ball. Actually, or Austin Theory. What the fuck are we talking about? And I like Theory. I'm still A-Town down. But come on, my nigga. Solo over Theory. That's three. Hey, and that shit. I don't mention Evil Shirt Prophet Switchblade. How does Switch? Worst champion of the year. They, I lied. These niggas do not know ball. Roman Reigns. Spelled undisputed wrong. 374 votes. CM Punk was right there. That fraudulent real world championship. And I love CM Punk. Ronda Rousey and Shayna were right there. Austin Theory was right here. Sonata was right here. But y'all vote Roman? Got dick riding. That's three. Worst worker of the year. Solo. Oh my God. That's four. Solo is not the worst worker of the year. It's literally run. Like, no hand shit, bro. But, like, I'm saying, like, if we be keeping it a buck, bro. 
And I fuck with Ronda. I think Ronda is like that in the ring when she cares. But come on, bro. Where's my chair? Bro, this shit was like a four star. They're fucking gassing it. The so well, how many how much is that, bro? The solo hate is outrageous, bro. I ain't gonna lie. Y'all not gonna convince me that Solo and John Cena didn't who we got technical Cena. He was literally working the thumb of Solo. Cena was hooping, bro. Y'all not gonna tell me otherwise. Y'all can't convince me otherwise, bro. That's one, two, three, four, five. That's fucking five. Five hating shits on Solo Sokoa, bro. Like, come on, my nigga. You tell me Solo that bad? Solo that bad? No. Nowhere near bad. All right, give me a break. Worst segment of the year. Jimmy tells that why he betrays Jay because he wants... What the fuck, Mauro? Can we, like, speak proper English? Jimmy tells Jay, Jay that he betrayed him because he wanted to protect him. That fucking won 445 blo votes. Blows everything else out of the water. Now, Tony Khan's gift to Sting. Hey, man, I ain't going to speak too much. Nah, this shit was crazy, bro. Finn was cutting one of his best promos. And the crowd literally hijacked that shit. That shit was annoying, bro. Is that six? Solo completely knocked Cena out with multiple Samoan spots. Nah, I hated that shit, bro. I wanted to fuck you, Triple H. Worst feud of the year. That's seven. John Cena versus Solo Sokoa. It's not the worst feud of the year, but whatever. Like y'all see what I'm saying, right? South Korea hates Solo Sokoa. Ah. Worst catchphrase of the year. Zah. I didn't even know that's that he was saying fucking Zuak. Who's that? Is that seven or eight? I lost count. That's like eight, bro. All right, come on, my nigga. Worst newcomer. How would how was these on a worst newcomer of the year? Adam Copeland. How the fuck was he to? How did Adam Copeland be Gable Stevenson? That's how I know this is some bullshit, bro. Now that's nine for Solo Sokoa. This shit is ass, bro. This this shit is ass. Where's Mike Worker to get Solo Sokoa 420? Could have easily put Tony Khan. You could have either. All right, bro. I don't even know why Drew and CM Punk and MJF and Roman are up here. Or even Claudio. Where's non wrestler of the year? Now, as much as I be hating on Tony Khan, Ben should have easily won this. This is crazy. Lee Seok Moo is the journalist and also career color commentator for WWE shows of IB Sports. He is heavily criticized by fans for his terrible commentary skills. Um, yo, they gave an example. Gunter enters number one in Royal Rumble match. Lee, Gunter is an Austrian professional wrestler. He's currently signed a... Yeah, I'm not reading all this shit, but... um. There's not a lot to read, but I, I can see why. Because they, hey, I don't want to hear the fucking whole background. In a fucking Royal Rumble match, I do not want to hear a nigga's whole background. What the fuck? That shit ass. I was overrated. That's like 10, bro. Solo Sokoa got like 10 worst awards. They dick riding. This is like dick riding. How the fuck is Tony Khan even on this shit? Most underrated, Chad Gable. He not underrated no more, bro. He's he's not. Christian Award most pity wrestler of the year. What the fuck does that mean? Whatever. Worst move solo spike. Samoa spike. Why they put two different spears? Yo, they're Dick Rider Roman, bro. They put two different spears. This is literally the same move, bro. Oh, it's a link to, oh, whatever, my nigga. Worst gimmick of the year. Yo, this is like 11, bro. Austin Theory should have easily won this. They're dick right. Fighting champion with back injury. Bro, we need to talk about that Seth shit, but I'm not going to talk about this video, but one day we need to talk about that shit, bro, because I'm tired of niggas acting like niggas do not compete while injured, bro, all the fucking time. Like, I don't know, bro. 
worst news of the year. No duh fucking Bray Wyatt passed away. How is that? How did this barely beat? This is how much wrestling fans hate Vince. Yo, this is how much wrestling fans hate Vince. The fact that Bray Wyatt passing away for the worst news of the year, the fact that Bray Wyatt passing away barely has more votes than Vince McMahon being back in charge at, uh, at Raw, bro. That's how you know niggas do not fuck with Vince, bro. That's how you fucking know. That shit crazy, bro. Bray's death should be blowing all this shit out the water, bro. But Vince, but Vince is second up with like, was that less than sixty? I don't even know, bro. That's wild. Worst team of the year, taking it all. No, 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 no. That shit hard. You gassed it. Johnny Argano's second team is hot ass. That shit should have won. Worst brand of the year, AW. <laughs> Hey, man. South Korea likes what South Korea likes, man. Worst of any Full gear? What the fuck? Fuck that shit. They could have easily... They could have voted fucking double or nothing. Nah, they're not cooking. Oh, my God. They're not fucking cooking. Worst part-timer of the year? Adam Copeland. 365 votes. I don't know how Paul White didn't win. Where's Booker of the year? Yeah, Tony Khan fucking got fucked. <laughs> Niggas know what it is. My boy Triple H is not. So y'all watch this main event. As much I, I, I love Roman, that's my boy. But y'all watch this main event. I give this shit like three stars, but whatever. You watch this main event. And you voted this main event. Y'all don't know ball. There's no way. South Korea do not know hoops. They don't know real grabs. They don't. Worst face turn of the year, MJF. How the fuck is that the worst face turn of the year? They could have voted Jericho, bro. I ain't going on front. They could have. Worst heel turn of the year, Jimmy. No, it's fucking Jack Perry, actually. If you have to make a choice. Botch of the year. Yeah, now nah, this was crazy. I ain't gonna fart. Shane suffering the torn quad was fucking wild. Yeah, this was bad, bro. But, um. Oh, yeah, this shit was ass too. El Hijo, that botching, that springboard shit. That was. And the way that niggas tried to play that shit off like it was psychology, like, stop that fucking capping. All right, man, that was all of it. Let me know what y'all think of the thought of these awards, man. I thought these shits were, they started off okay. I think these shits were hot ass. Um, South Korea, y'all don't know ball. Stop talking about graps, y'all don't know graps. If y'all like this video, make sure y'all drop a like, man. Make sure y'all leave a comment. Make sure y'all subscribe. Make sure y'all join the Burger Appreciation Society in my bio. The best Discord in the wrestling community, man. I'm off this shit. Oh my god, they were they were yapping.